SpaceX and Blue Origin both had big launches last week, and both ended in mishap investigations from the FAA. Let's break it down. Both rockets launched on January 16th. This was the first flight of Blue Origin's new Glenn Orbital class rocket. It's the first time the company has ever tried to reach orbit with a rocket. Their tourist flights on New Shepard are suborbital. The flight went great, the rocket reached orbit successfully, it successfully deployed its test payload. But the trouble came in landing the first stage of the rocket. They were supposed to land on a ship in the Gulf of Mexico. The rocket successfully started a re-entry burn, and right before that burn was supposed to end, something went wrong. We don't really know what, Blue Origin hasn't told us much. The FAA opened a mishap investigation because of this. Now with SpaceX, it's kind of the opposite. This was their seventh test flight of their Starship vehicle and super heavy booster. The booster landed back at the launch site as intended. It was actually even more spectacular than it was the first time. But the upper stage Starship broke up in flight over Turks and Caicos. We think it's because of a propellant and oxidizer leak, but we'll have to wait to know anymore. What we do know is that the debris rained down over Turks and Caicos. There were no injury reports, but there are investigations into property damage. Until the problem is pinpointed, a solution is presented, and the FAA can be sure there's no danger to the public, both rockets are grounded.